Ladies and gentlemen, a very warm welcome to the launch of Singapore Road Safety Month SRSM 2022. May I now invite our guest of honour, Associate Professor Mohamed Faisal Ibrahim to deliver his speech, please. Hello everyone, it is my pleasure to launch this year's Singapore Road Safety Month. Our roads have become safer over the years. In 2010, there were 193 traffic accident fatalities. This improved to 118 fatalities in 2019. Last year, there were 107 fatalities, although this is partly attributed to lower traffic volume arising from the pandemic. Nevertheless, the overall trend is encouraging. It shows that our efforts to improve road safety have gone through. Our approach to road safety is a holistic one. We work closely with other agencies such as LTA to ensure that our road infrastructure and regulations facilitate road safety. At the same time, we implement education and engagement initiatives to remind road users to be gracious and responsible and to adopt road safety habits. All of these measures are complemented by our enforcement measures to deter and apprehend errant road users who drive irresponsibly. Let me now talk about the Singapore Road Safety Month. This campaign is a joint effort between Traffic Police, or TP in short, and the Singapore Road Safety Council, or SRIC. The aim is to advance the road safety agenda by educating and engaging various stakeholder groups. This year, the Singapore Road Safety Man campaign will feature three aspects. First, the SRIC will launch a Friends of SRIC Volunteer Scheme. Under this scheme, members of public can sign up and volunteer as road safety advocates. Advocates will assist SRSC in sharing road safety messages through their personal networks and platforms and help the SRSC front physical campaigns and initiatives. Second, the campaign will launch infographics and video advisories targeted at young students and their parents. For example, banners and posters will be put up at school zones to remind pedestrians to use designated crossing channels and motorists to use designated venues for pickup and drop off. Short, bite sized road safety videos will also be introduced via social media platform. Third, to educate the public at large, the SRIC will put up road safety advisories on posters and banners island-wide to remind motorists not to speed and to comply with traffic signals. To conclude, road safety is a shared responsibility. I encourage everyone to join in these activities and spread the road safety messages to your friends and loved ones. Together, we can help keep our roads safe and secure. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Please proceed to the centre area for the launch ceremony. At this juncture, we would like to invite the following guests to join our guest of honour to launch the Singapore Road Safety Month, SRSM 2022. They are Mr. Bernard Day, JP, BBM, PBM, Chairman, Singapore Road Safety Council. <laughs> SAC Gerald Lim, Commander, Traffic Police. And Mr. Chandra Seka, Group Director, Traffic and Road Operations LTA. So ladies and gentlemen, we've come to the moment we've all been waiting for, the launch of Singapore Road Safety Month SRSM 2022. Three, two, one. Thank you, sirs. Can we please face the screen because we are going to unveil the logo 